Hello, my name is Julia Boni and today I want to show you around in my art studio. This is my main desk. Uh, I mostly work here standing. I have everything around me and that's the spot where I'm sitting down, mostly for my pen pastels. My own art journals, some artwork I already made a long time ago. My beautiful lovely ladies, my birds, um, some inspiration from other artists, my brushes. These are my watercolor brushes. This is my handle where I make my videos. Very easy, let me take some distance. What you also can see here is two lamps. One, two daylight lamps. Let me get the light there and here. So you can see how I will work underneath here and those two lights will get away the shade. This is my other phone where I make my films with. Um, two glasses of water always for my watercolors. My sharpeners from Durbans. Uh, my speaker. My collection of Chinese brushes. My watercolors. Okay, that's neat, you know. That I've cleaned. <laughs> You can't have enough of porcelain trays of palais. I have several my paints, but mostly I like this and this underneath here. It has to be on top. Not these are my colors for my studio. So these are my studio watercolors and if I'm on the road I take this one with me very nice one sable the other one is sable it's difficult when you only have one hand left but okay and this one I like this one I created myself those are not licorice but they are my mini Daniel Smith and recently I bought myself this one from Etcher Lab. And I have a porcelain tray with my uh, watercolor from Daniel Smith. But there's also a porcelain palette. Okay, I have to clean that. <laughs> So next to my uh, Daniel Smith, of course Derwent, as an ambassador of Derwent, I have a lot of Derwents. Let me show you these. These are, let me see. This is the first one, Ink Tens. This is the second one, Ink Tens Travel Set. And then there are now a metallic one and the graphite tint. So there are also travel brushes like these. Uh, I like them a lot because here you can put water in so you don't need any extra water and or, or these little ones, just what you want to prefer. But um, yeah, I like them. Uh, next to my watercolors, pan pesto. So here you can find my organization or my collection of sponges and tools of the pan pastels. And here you can find my pan pastels. So this is the whole collection and this is my own tray. Here you can see some artwork that I made with pan pastels, even here. And let me put on the light. 
because you already saw it. I have a walk-in closet in my studio for all my supplies. My own design stamps and stencils from Pronti Crafts by Julia Boni. My brushes, my books, my acrylics. You can't have enough. <laughs> I'm a hoarder. So here I have slide doors and I go back to the other walk-in closet and here you can find my paper. Um, for drawing I like the artist paper from Schut, a Dutch brand. For my pen pastel I'm using pastel mat. You have several blocks with different kinds of colors and different sizes. Um, the latest one I've got is the paint on this color, the denim blue. Gorgeous. But it's a combination of all kinds of colors, so I'm liking this one a lot. Then I have large papers of watercolor. I like the Schut Glad Terschelling, but I'm also liking Fontaine, Van Claire Fontaine watercolor. And the latest one is this one. Let me see if I can get the grain on it. Yeah, here you can see it. Uh, this is Out Holland, 535 grams. It's almost very thick, but I love it. Um, pastel mat. You see my pencils. Here I've got my light fast, my easels here, there, and I've got my pencils here. Let me see. These are the color soft. These are the pro color. These are my light fast from Derwin. I love them. Um, here I have a collection of all kinds of different brands. Even my older one, the Charismas. Um, my pastel pencils different brand pastel pencils, the ink tents, the ink tents blocks. Here you can see my Dutch books. Uh, drawing, pen pastel, coloring technique and art journaling. Those are all in Dutch. There will be a English version of my workshop pen pastel book. So this was the tour of my art studio. I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, bye!